Welcome to Tennis Spin, where we put our spin on your tennis. Coach Koo broke another one. At least with the stringlings, it's buying me about maybe 10, 12 hours of playtime on the Selenko Torbite 15L. But our buddy, James Tang Fang from Singapore, sent us what might be a solution. Stay tuned. All right, so our buddy James, who's a good friend of the channel, is always sending us stuff to uh, try. I mean, he's pretty much seen uh, Coach Goop or me breaking or, uh, or uh, complaining about him breaking strings so fast. And uh, he says, I have a solution for you. I kind of know what it is already, but it's kind of a Kevlar. You guys remember Pro Blend? Well, you guys know a company called 410 or Fortin? It's called Thin Blend. Yo, where are you? It's wet. What, what are you talking about? It's wet. It's barely wet out here. You, it's rain. What? It's not even raining. Come on, man. Let's get some tennis in, dude. <sighs> all right, all right, all right. Fine. Jesus, it's not even raining. Okay. All right. We'll try again another day. <sighs> Do you want to partner who's reliable who'll play with you no matter what condition player court is the place they got over 27,000 people who will play with you check out playyourcourt.com forward slash tennis spin and find your perfect partner So this is kind of a version of ProBlend that Prince made. But ProBlend was 16 and 16. This is 18 by 17. So we got 18 gauge Kevlar on the mains. Yep, that's Kevlar on it. it. Even smells like Kevlar. It's got that Kevlar smell. And then we got Syngut. 17 on the cross. I remember this string actually. This uh, this has been around for a while. Let's see what it says. Thin blend air mid composites hybrid. This blend is durable, powerful yet playable combination. The main string is the new age 18 gauge. The cross is our sweet 17 string. The two team up to provide durability, enhanced power, terrific spin. Ooh, I'm going to have to control his spin with the stringlings. And astonishing playability. This string truly represents the dawning of a new age of Raga Sports. Okay. Yeah. I know it's been around for a while. Okay. I think I might just string it. Yeah. I'm going to string this up for him. Let's see how tight I should do it, though. Maybe 52. We'll see what 52 is since it's so thin. And then stringling it up. And then we'll see how long it lasts. Hopefully, at least 10 hours. At least. But... Those stringlings are going to definitely help. He's going to break this cross. That's what I'm worried about. All right, so let's get it strung. 
See you on the court. So, our buddy James Tangy yep. Fang, yeah, thin blend, thin blend. So I strung yours, fifty-two pounds, okay, and obviously I put the stringlings in, yeah, because you just wanted to, because I know the seventeen gauge cross is going to break. Okay, yeah. I, I think the eighteen gauge Kevlar <coughs> might not, but <laughs> but I don't want knowing that you, cross no, to break. knowing you, knowing you, knowing you, you will still put Kevlar in anything in my racket. Well, this is way better. <coughs> okay, well, tell me what you thought. Okay. What you I mean, the Kevlar on this actually is more playable. Um, it's just there's more play, more playability behind it. It does move usually Kevlar at 17 or 8, 16. Or, yeah, pretty much is unmovable. It's pretty much what you get. It's a slingshot. Um, that's why you create arm problems. Um, but this one actually is thin enough that it moves. It can actually move, and and I feel like it's easier to play with and you wield with. I mean, it still gives you the pop that Kevlar is known for. It always no is known for power. But there's more playability, there's more spin. You, there is a bit more spin and easier access to spin. It's not like a full poly where, it, you know, it snaps back quick. It does take a process to snap back, but it is playable. Let's put it that way. It is definitely playable. Let's say if you're a person that was in Kevlar or using Kevlar, is looking for some playability that doesn't kill your arm. I mean, this is a pretty good blend to that. It's, you know, working your way from a, if you're a Kevlar hybrid to trying to be poly, but you still want your Kevlar. And then if you transition to full poly, it'll be, this is kind of the mid ground of it. Yeah, this is quieter than I thought it would be. The, the it is a bit quieter, the yeah. The synthetic actually is quieting <clears> down <throat> that poly. Well, poly isn't stiff like a poly anyways. It's yeah. just dead. It's just dead. That's all. But I think it's like, with Kevlar, you can hear that weird sound usually. Like, like, I, cracking. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> cracking of my bones, that's what pretty much he's trying to say. But yes, it has that loud cracking sound when you hit through Kevlar, but this one actually didn't sound like that. It sounded more of actual more poly crisp. string. So it sounded like a true full poly string, if that makes sense. So yeah, this is really surprising to me. And I mean, if you want to try it out, I would say you can. It's super, it's still it's lively. It's lively and it's pretty much like still really good. I mean, it's like pretty so shocking to me, honestly. This is probably the liveliest string he's played with in probably a year. <laughs> Honestly, yes, that is probably true. <laughs> knowing knowing Harry, yeah, this is pretty lively. I was shocked how, how much it moved and it was coming off my strings, actually. Yeah. So it, it is really lively, but fun. It's fun. Yeah. So going from basically a 15L uh, <coughs> tour bite, and then I was experimenting because it was just breaking it so fast. I yeah, went I appreciate with, it. I went with Kevlar 16 and tour bite 16 on and the And destroyed cross, my arms. And that was like no good, really well, hard. He, well, he wanted, to, he wanted me to try it for a week and I couldn't even bear no, it for two or three no, days. You no. played with it too. Yeah, you no, that thing it. was like nothing. You couldn't get any power out of that thing. Well, but this, on the <laughs> yeah. other hand, this one is the definitely. opposite. This is the opposite, yeah. Like so, Harry said, it is. When he played with it too, I mean, we lively. both already knew it was lively and Spin. yeah. Catapults off, surprisingly does. And yeah. uh, if you are a person who breaks the mains and only the mains. This is a good substitute. Yes. It is this is going to be really, really hard. To Not break. sure if it's going to be great for your long arm in the long run, but it does its job. <laughs> yep. And it'll give you spin because it's thin. Uh, mm -hmm. give you feel because we got the 18 gauge and then the 17 gauge on the cross. So, yeah. um, so thank you, James yeah. Tang Yi Fang from Singapore for sending this over. Um, he pretty much sent that over just for you. Oh, thank, thank you. I so appreciate it. Thank you, you so much. You want to save your arm. Uh, it, somewhat save my arm. <laughs> yeah, at least he's doing a better job than you when you put Kevlar and freaking tour bite on mine. Well, let's see how long this lasts on the racket. Uh, Coach right, Guru, goodbye to you. You can find me at AGU.tennis. I'll also be posting content there as well.
Thank you for watching Tennis Spin, where we put our spin on your tennis.